Hello guys, in today's video, we're gonna check out the best cookie cutters in this year. I made this list based on my personal opinion, and I've tried to list them based on their price, quality, durability, and many more. To find out more information about these cookie cutters, you can check out the description below. If you wanna get a best quality cookie cutters according to your needs, then watch the video till the end and then decide to buy. At the first position of our list, we have Wilton 2304 1050 101 piece cookie cutter set. This set is amazing for kids. And if you're an adult cutting out sugar cookies for fun, this Wilton set will be fun for you too. The first thing I love about this set is the sheer amount of cutters. There are 101 reasons to just find a surface, pour these out, and begin to choose whatever shape you want. It's sheer joy. Add in the bright primary colors, the easy way these cut, and the size, perfect for smaller hands. When you have kids to entertain, there's the extra learning bonus of having numbers and letters to help them build words or messages. Afterward, run them clean through the dishwasher and pop them back into the bucket for storage. Moving on to the next and number two with the Lexo Good Grips Cookie Press Set. If you like spritz cookies, you need a cookie press. Oh, sure, you can make the spritz recipe and bake little mounds of dough. But a press gives you decorative cookies with very little effort. Just load the dough into the press and extrude the dough right onto your cookie sheet. The OXO press has a non-slip base that keeps it stable on the cookie sheet and a large non-slip lever that makes it easy to dispense the dough. The press disassembles easily for cleaning. Cookie presses usually include rather generic disc-shaped dies that make flour-like cookies, but the OXO cookie press goes a step further. With seasonal dies that create more intricate and unusual designs, the press comes with this to get you started with the daisy, flower, sunflower, florida lis, butterfly, bear, shell, leaf, heart, snowflake, tree, and a wreath. The number three position is held by Joseph Joseph Adjustable Rolling Pin with Removable Rings. When you're reading a cookie recipe that requires the dough to be rolled to a 1 slash 4 inch thickness, how do you measure? And how do you make sure the thickness is even all across the dough? That precise thickness means cookies would bake evenly, but it's not easy to achieve with a regular rolling pin. This pin, however, includes removable rings that ensure that you're rolling a precise 1 slash 16, 1 slash 6, 1 slash 4, or 3 slash 8 inch thickness. The rings slide easily on and off the pin and have measurements marked right on the ring so you'll always know what thickness you've chosen. When you're done making cookies, you can use the pin for pizza or pastry dough or remove the rings to do some free form rolling. The pin is made from beechwood and the rings are plastic. This should be washed by hand. Next at number four, we have Bake Buddy Jumbo Pastry Mat with measurements. This pastry mat makes cookie making easier with a non-stick surface that makes it easier to lift your cookies off the mat. While it also makes cleanup a snap since the mess is contained on the large 20x30 mat. Even better, you can use this to roll cookies on any flat surface. So when you've got more helpers than kitchen space, you can use this mat on your kitchen or dining room table. The mat's bottom surface is designed so it won't slip or skid as you roll. So you can put pressure on the dough you're rolling without worrying about it getting away from you. This is more than a simple mat, though. It also has handy conversion charts printed on the surface. So you won't need to dig out a cookbook or calculator when you need to adapt a recipe. There are measurements along the edges and circular measures for making round pie dough that's the perfect size for your pie plate. The number five position is held by Wilton Cookie Flooding Decorating Kit. A layer of royal icing on top of a cookie gives you a smooth, clean, crumb-free base for further designs, whether you're planning on piping or drawing. This kit makes it easy to flood that royal icing onto the cookies and also includes tools for fancier techniques. The etching tool is used to add details using the color dragging technique, and the three-prong comb is used for marbling and feathering. The silicone scraper tool is used for making smooth, flawless edges. You don't need to be a decorating expert to use these tools. They'll make the job much easier for novices as well, and much easier than trying to use a salad, fork, or chopsticks as substitutes. The number six position is dominated by OXO Good Grip Silicone Cookie Spatula. If you make cookies, you absolutely need this spatula. The design is perfect for sneaking underbaked cookies on the cookie sheet, even when the cookies have spread or close to the edges of the pan. If you're making bark cookies, 
This is ideal for getting those brownies or lemon bars out of the pan, too. The soft silicone edge won't damage non-stick surfaces or gouge baking mats, yet it's thin enough to slide easily under the cookie while the rigid center keeps the cookie flat, so it won't crack or break. The cookies slide easily off of the non-stick surface of the spatula. You can also use this to transfer unbaked cookie dough to your baking sheet, and the rounded edge of the spatula can be used to scrape dough from spoons or the corners of a mixing bowl. Moving on to the next and number 7 with Nordicware 2-piece half sheet set. If you're baking cookies, a good baking sheet can make all the difference. Thin sheets can warp, and cookies are more likely to burn. This half sheet aluminum pan is made to last. The half sheet size refers to commercial bakeware sizes and is the largest sheet that will fit comfortably in home ovens. The aluminum conducts heat evenly so your cookies will rise and bake evenly. And the reinforced rim keeps the sheet rigid so it will never warp. Since this doesn't have a non-stick coating, you don't need to worry about using metal utensils to get under cookies or to scrape off burned sugar. When you're not baking cookies, this can be used for roasting vegetables, baking meatloaf, or even roasting a chicken. This sheet is made in America, and it should be washed by hand. The number 8 position is held by Zach Design Zach. Designs confetti mixing bowls. This mixing bowl set is just retro enough to be highly fashionable, and it's durable as well. The four-piece set nests easily for storage and gives you options for just the right bowl size for pre-measuring ingredients or for mixing large or small batches of cookie dough. The set includes a 4.75-quart bowl, a 3.4-quart bowl, a 1.75-quart bowl, and an 18-ounce bowl. The bowls have a rim that makes them easy to hold onto, and they are attractive enough to use for casual serving, for snacks or as a fruit bowl. They're made from colorful melamine that is dishwasher safe. These should not be used in the microwave. This set is available in several different color combinations to match or contrast with your kitchen decor. Next at number 9 we have Wilton Perfect Results 3-Tier Cooling Rack Set. Making cookies. Then you need a cooling rack, or two. How about three? This set of three racks is just under 10 x 16 inches, which is large enough to comfortably hold a dozen average cookies. But not so large that you are moving things around to make space. Each rack has fold-down legs, and the legs allow the racks to be stacked. So you can cool three batches of cookies in the space of just one rack. These have a non-stick coating for easy cleaning, and the cookies will never stick. They are dishwasher safe, but very easy to clean by hand. The racks are not oven safe. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by OXO Good Grips Medium Cookie Scoop. Sure, you can use a pair of spoons to portion your favorite drop cookies onto a baking sheet, but it's nearly impossible to make cookies all the same size using that method. A cookie scoop solves the problem, and it makes the job much faster. Just dip into the dough, scrape the excess against the side of the bowl, and squeeze the handles to deliver the ball of dough to the cookie sheet. The soft grip handles are easy on the hands, so you can fill several sheets full of cookies in comfort. This medium-sized scoop holds one one slash two tablespoons of dough. If that's not your perfect cookie, there's a small scoop that holds two teaspoons and a large scoop that holds three tablespoons. When they're not in use making cookies, you can use them to scoop fillings into deviled eggs, to portion cupcake batter into mini muffin cups, or to get creative with your ice cream servings. The scoop is dishwasher safe for easy cleaning. That's all for today. We upload all types of kitchen products, review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.